You're watching a segment of Shiftcast. If you want to see the full show, head over to the live tab on YouTube or get to Spotify to listen to the full episode. Enjoy. We've got something that we're going to try here for the first time um, on Shiftcast. And what we're going to do is we're going to have Michael give us his uh, top 16 teams in the world. And y'all correct me if I'm wrong here, but what I think we're going to do is Jens and I are both going to, uh, we're going to pick one issue that we have with the list, something that we would change, something that we don't like. Does that sound, are we on it there? Yeah, I mean, you guys are already wrong. There's nothing wrong with the list. <laughs> I'm more than happy to, call, to be called to the stand and be persecuted for my ball knowledge. Let's get right to it. Yeah, so we all probably know that Shift 16, which is done by... Uh, Michael, me, and some other people on, on Shift um, that all put our top 16 together to create one list. But now it's just Michael, so let's hear it. I stand alone. I'm like John, John Snow in that one scene. Yeah, <laughs> that's actually right. what's going to happen. All the viewers are just charging you. <laughs> number 16, number 16. Who we got number 16? It is grid serve, resolve. Mm. Listen, it's hard to pick the teams, hard to pick the teams, but listen, the top four in Europe is a top four in Europe. This is a power ranking. It is. They got to be mentioned. They have to be mentioned. Yeah, I think it's fair. Number 15, I got Team Secret. Kind of the space station gaming of Sam last year. Kept getting bracketed. Sure. Finally got a chance. Beat a really, really good W7M team. Beat a really, really good and uh, complexity team. And then fell to the same team everyone else falls to in Sam. Number 14, Luminosity Gaming. I know they had a bad, a bad uh, showing. We'll talk about more of that a little bit later, but they had a good showing at LAN, and I still think they're one of the premier teams in North America. Number 13, Complexity. I think it's been a little bit overrated how, how bad not or how much they've been downgraded or whatever since they lost to Rito. Top four in Sam is top four in Sam. It's a good region, and I think that they are still a, a really, really solid team. 12, New entry, Twisted Minds. I think they're going to fit right into where Rule 1 was. I really, really like the way they play. Uh, I think there's a decent Mina 2 that I think can make a little more noise now that there's less noise around them, uh, or less noise around Ahmad, I should say. Number 11, another new entry, Space Station Gaming. I think uh, I was a doubter. I thought that the, the bracketed allegations were cope, but they showed me wrong, and they dominated teams that they were quote-unquote bracketed out of the major on. Um, and I think they look better. I think LJ is looking better than he has since uh, last year's Worlds. So, yeah. Number 10, Luna Galaxy. All right. Uh, I've already said I really like this team. They got to show me a little more, but I like them. Number nine, Oxygen. Uh, they're going to peek into this top eight soon, but you got to respect those teams. Number eight, BDS. Slipping, but still have so much talent. Number seven, Furia. I don't think they can really move up until... The major, to be honest with you, they're so so good, but they really just left the sour. I, I need more. To, I need to see more of that. They, they showed me so much in that Swiss stage and just didn't do it. Didn't do it for me in that in that quarterfinal. Number six, I got G two. Great team, great team. Love mode, uh, but just haven't been able to beat the big boys lately. They got to be able mode, to get in. Mode, please. That. Number mode. five, uh, silence, please. Thank you. Uh, I'm reading this. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, number five, the European Champions team, Vitality. I had I was pretty low on them going into this uh, split in terms of my power rankings, but they've shown me a lot. It's just that these other teams have a little bit better of a resume. Number four, the highest uh, expansion region team, Team Falcons. Still, uh, I think, a premier team and part of that elite S-tier crop of like true world championship winning level teams. Number three, you already know, Gen G Mobile One Racing, need I say more. Number two, Carmi Corp. Uh, I think they their floor is higher than any other team's floor since maybe <clears throat> like Vitality last year when their floor was winning. Um, and number one, <clears throat> the best team in the world, excuse me, currently is General Mates Alpine. Won the major, came back with the championship, uh, three, ma three finals in their events and one win being the biggest win of the season. I think they still deserve that number one on the power rankings. And uh, yeah, there's my... Shift cast 16. Mm, fire away. I'm ready. In, so would you like to go right. or? Ah, you go first. Okay. Well, Michael, at the number three spot, you said, Gen G, need I say more? Yes, you do need to say more. Because what are they doing in the number three spot? 
They should not be ahead of Falcons. And frankly, after this win, I don't think they should be ahead of Vitality either. The only team that, in my opinion, is really worth valuing their win over in North America is G2. I think they should be beating everyone else. And it's a tough position to be in because I don't want to give them a ton of credit for beating those teams, but we will take away if they lose. You know what I mean? It's a, it's a tough balancing act. But I think beating G2 there, it's a solid win. I think it's fair to have them bounce G2. Totally, uh, you know, totally on board with that. But top three, I just don't think so. Falcons at the major was mm. unbelievable. I know that they finished, mm. both teams finished in that fifth or eighth spot. But I think we can all agree that Falcons looked better um, in Swiss and in their loss against Carmi Corp. I got Falcons in that top three. And with Vitality's performance this past weekend, I think they should be ahead of Gingy as well. Well, listen, you guys listen, say listen. more, he said, huh? Need listen, I say listen. more? Yes. I like that. I like the Falcons pick. I'm gonna be honest. I was really, really picking between those two. Here's my question: What's the point of Rocket League? It's to win the tournament, right? Yep. And so, to beat the best, you gotta be to be the best. You gotta beat the best, right? Rudy, can you tell me the score between the Falcons and the best team in the world when they played Atlanta? Rio, can you tell me the score between Gen G Mobile One Racing <laughs> and the best team in the world at land? Nah. Four to three. I'm not finished. G2, right? Uh -huh. the, remind me what happened between G2 and Vitality, the European champions, when they played at land. Um, G2 won. 4 3, they won. It was a great series. Who has been kicking G2's ass for two months? <laughs> Gen G Mobile One Racing, <laughs> need I say more? <laughs> There you go. A little <laughs> MMA math, but I'm making it work. Jason Nation, we're so back. Let's need go. I say more. Need I That's say more? You, you need to say less. That's what you need to do. <laughs> <laughs> this is not about Gen G. We're just on our Johnny Boy arc because I have something wrong with your list as well. And it's a 12th place for Twisted Minds. Did you see how close they got to Team Falcons? They need to be up there. 12th yeah. is not enough. They need well, you to gotta, be up there. You got to show me a little more. Like, I want to put them higher. I really do. I think they're really good. But, like, you know how this, like, format is. They could go out, like, 9-12 next regional. Like, it's just that, that you don't know with, with, with yeah. these things. And so I would like to see a little consistency, you know, such as maybe beating the best team in your region four times in a row before I start putting you up there. I thought rule one was overrated last split. I think... Twisted Minds has been a little bit underrated just because they don't have a big name the way that uh, Rule 1 did and uh, sort of the community support behind the org based on who it's associated with. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm more than happy to put them up there, but, like, it's one good result from a team. And I know you want to use – you. I've heard you use that word before, that honeymoon word. So I need to see a little consistency before I you put them up with I the BDSs. I wasn't going to use it. I put them I just, over complexity. I just think they're stronger – I put them over. Okay, but who are you? Who are you, who are they beating out of that, out of that out of that top eleven? You know, they're not be, like maybe SSG, so the team right below them. I think they could beat the Luna Galaxy too. I think they beat Luna Galaxy. Yeah, yeah. If Actually, they, they can't beat going, SSG. Going, I don't know what I'm talking about. If they're going they to game seven, if they're going to game seven with Falcons and Falcons win that game seven in with, with ten seconds left, I think they could compete. Yeah, no, I mean, they I, can I, compete, I but like complexity beat Furia. In Sam, like oh, look complexity. at where they are now. Yeah, but Old I'm saying like I'm saying yeah. like first split, first the complexity <laughs> won against Furia and then went to the major and didn't look competitive with the world top eight. So like there's a difference between being able to compete with them, which I think Twisted Minds can. Okay, they can't fair. compete with SSG. I lied about that because you know what LJ does to the the mean team. Oh my god, I would get the LJ <laughs> up again, my again. Nah, nah, nah. we're only. I got a joke I'm not going to say about LJ because uh, it, it's you know it's it's not appropriate, but with LJ in the middle. Amina, they don't want to see him. That's a reason they they don't let him go to G8. He's going this year, or whatever it's called now. He's going to go there, and he's causing a madness. He's a nah. beast against those Middle East teams. They can't do the little low 50s on you when you're going full speed, double tap, clank, bottom right. It's not about that. Twisted Minds are a good team, and uh, I would love to see them get higher up with further results. Go be Falcons. Go be Falcons and prove me wrong. Yeah, Mom, I mean, it just, I that. just think in the world right now, Mina is just that. stronger and then still underrated. Uh, I mean, you don't have X or one on your list. Uh, we'll get to that later, but it, it makes they sense. One, 
Mina 2 went 1-3 at LAN. They did worse than OCE. I don't... Yeah. I, I, oh. I'm not interested. Why'd you say that with such vitriol? Like, Mina 2 and OCE 2 had the same record, and I'm supposed to believe Mina 2 is a top 10 team in the world. I know you said that... The, I know, you know, ShiftCast exclusive, there were some issues, but, like... Come on, we can we can we I, at least see them beat? I think Falcons we're first? moving. I believe we're moving to a situation where Mina Two is actually more competitive. Yes, no, I, I totally. Do believe... But they got to do it first. Yeah, fair I, enough. I, fair I enough. You, you, you put up some good defense there, Michael. You put up some good defense, and ultimately, I don't think it's a bad list Straps. by any means. Straps. Maybe we can make some tweaks. Here's the good news: you're gonna drop your. Uh, takes in the chat below or in the comments below you can leave your top 16 you could rip apart michael's list if you want and i think we're going to have yens and i do one of these in future episodes so yes. make sure you come back and uh before anyone in the comments says as it, well before anyone in the comments says it no i did not put luminosity too low and no that's not recency bias just gonna <laughs> pre-jump that one thank you <laughs> Uh, there's someone that's furiously tapping on the keyboard that is really angry just, that you just called just him out. Just looked right? up. <laughs> <laughs> How did he know? <laughs> all right. Yeah, I mean, the French people can't understand me. They'd be up my ass, too. And they would be mad, too. It's all good. <laughs> all right. Well, there is uh, Michael's top 16. Um, as they said, Shift is going to drop their top 16. And if he didn't make it clear, it's kind of like an aggregate list. There's a, a panel of people that makes their own top 16, and then they just average those to make a Shift brand at top 16. Y'all check them out. And, um, you know, get in on the fire. Shift typically deals with... We actually... Plenty. People have been nice to us this year. Have okay. they? People have been quite actually, nice Actually, especially the last edition. Yeah. It's like, damn, you guys cooked. We've gotten, like, a few, <laughs> Whoa, like, finally... Good nice. Nice. It's just because it's yeah. so cut and dry for now. For once. Like, sure, for sure. once. Best teams. It's, it's easy. Well, y'all soak yeah. it up because uh, it may not be that way again this time. Yeah. No, no, yeah. no. But uh, we're ready. Tweet at us. All right. Tweet at us. <laughs> that was just a segment of Shiftcast. Full episode is on the live tab on YouTube or on Spotify, and you can watch another segment right here.